We've got a couple of these left. We've got the Inheritance and the Ghosts of Sawayama. So these are like... These might be the last two si uh, side missions in the game because we're pretty much running out of main missions, I think. Visit at the shrine real quick. We have a new one to take a look at. The Atlas Bear. Spirit protection, as usual. It's always 20%. It almost feels weird to list it when it's not different from each enemy. Uh, increase damage when you have low key. Life recovery by grappling. Close combat damage. That's pretty neat if it's just a, just a general thing. Short recovery time when you're out of key. Oh, not terrible. It takes 23 spirit, but it's not terrible. The Izuna, that's the big, that's the luck dragon, basically. <laughs> Don't know if I'm super interested in these things. What's this bottom one say that's scrolling too slowly? Temporarily restores health over time when using, when you finish using a living weapon. That's neat. Eh. I think I like my current one. It's got a fun mechanic to play around with the idea that you can essentially, essentially come back from the dead for a bit. The Ghosts of Sawayama. The battle at Sawayama Castle has ended. But beneath the castle, the foreigner's loathsome engine still remains. There have been reports of some sort of mysterious crystalline things appearing. Such perversions have no place in the coming world of peace. And so, Sir Anjan, I ask that you remove this machine from beneath the castle, along with any yokai that may be there too. Once again, I am ashamed by my own powerlessness. There was one who said he was a certain... He saw a certain general from the Osaka faction among the soldiers who flew. Fled. Be wary. So we probably have a tease of what the boss fight's gonna be. Hi. Unpleasant. Huh. I get that this is creepy snake dungeon, but he actually made giant snakes in every direction, huh? And as per, as per usual, we are just uh, spawning in the... Uh, the final boss chamber. That took some work. I didn't really fully absorb what this room looked like because I was so preoccupied with the boss fight that I was happening in it. All right, so time to get get used to getting lost in here again. We're supposed to destroy the crystals that have appeared here. Hope it works out. Is that what you're talking about? Just those vials, maybe? It does seem like it's pointing at it, yeah. That was it? Okay, so just find those. Gotcha. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. So, the, my, uh oh, that was a mistake. My previous approach of, uh, of taking that out in advance. Pretty good call. Wow. Kind of blew that, didn't I? Oh, bad news for him. There we go. Made it work. So attacking those things is I- Oh, those are the crystals. So the vials and those crystals must both count. But yeah, the, the first time around I shot one of those things and that clearly is the right call. Bye bye. How you doing? Wow, wow. He kept his- He's on his feet. <laughs> not learning though. Not not now. There we go. He stayed on his feet when I stabbed him through the spine. Impressive. Only once though. Second time around couldn't keep that up. What? I may as well rest. Seems we're done here and now I'm heading back out. Am I gonna be going upstairs, I wonder? Because I actually... I guess I never did that, did I? Is there gonna be a boulder again? Hi. Ow. Hey. Oops. 
Oh, bad timing. Take a bite of your stamina. There's like a whole region up here. Oh, you got me through the wall. Sneaky, sneaky. There we go. Who would build this? <laughs> hey, it's another one of these guys. Ball sack. Nope. Never mind. I miscounted. I thought the top of the yeah. I thought the top part was another was another line, but it was not. Where do you go? That's it, huh? Just goes down. Oh. Broken stairs, though. Oh, is it? Is it a separate layer? I think it's a completely separate layer of staircase that's interworked with the rest of it, just like in An Orlando, where there's like a double double staircase that goes that kind of interlocks in two different directions. That's a neat touch. Hi. Bad time for you! Anyone else? Hi. Hi. I thought, just kind of thought he would loop forever. There's the killing blow we're going for. I don't know, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to take you out. Ow. Oh. Plus one. This seems like dead ends. Gotta find myself to another crystal. Hi. Whoa. Stone Guardians are back. Haven't seen them for a while. Oh. Well, that's not great. Get out. Keep it going. There's, there's the lethal blow. Ow. Whoop. <laughs> That's gone. Gotcha. Ow. These are working out decently at the moment. Still a little turned around. Oh, this time I don't know where my I don't know yet where my destinations are, so I guess it doesn't really matter too much. Just keep wandering in new directions and, so, and hope I find the thing on, that is the objective. Hi. Speaking of which, time to restock on arrows again. Thank you. Oh, I fell for that one. I forgot that they were always less durable than expected. I guess the idea is that they're just really brittle, despite their presumed hardness. Hi. Oh no. Bad move. Hi. Oh. Oh no. That's not great news. I bring you bombs. Oop. Oh. Oop. Oh. Oop. Oh. More bombs. Get out. Get out. Fun times. I did not make contact. Crap. Ow. Thank, thank you. That's just what I was hoping for. Bad news for you. Ow. 
Whoa! Forgot about that one. <laughs> that was a fun one. Ah. He gets aggressive. Oh, out of key. Problem. Oh, I'm missing. Oh, crap. God damn. Ah. Uh. That one, that went poorly. I was like, "Oh, there we go. That's our. That's my chance for a lethal blow. This will be over in just a second. No big deal." Then I started deflecting my weapon off the wall. I'm like, "Oh, crap!" Ah! And now I've got to find my way back. Crap! All right. I guess we'll give it another shot. Hi. Bad news for you. You're super on fire now. Hee <laughs> Oh, he did not go upstairs. Not that time. Okay. Ah. Hee hee hee. Ah. Oh, I'm getting stuck on debris. That's that's not gonna help me. Oh. How you doing? Doing good. Nope. That didn't that didn't go off. There we go. Nope. A little more of that. Yes. <laughs> Make it go. Yes. Nope. Watch out. That's not good. Here comes the bad news. Oh crap, where am I? Oh, there's the ramp. <laughs> Trying to space myself out a little bit here. Nope. Oh. Damn it. Wow. Wow. That was a lot of damage. From the grunts. Jesus. Uh-oh. I don't need you having backup, damn it. Damn it. Da. Dear Lord. <laughs> he's just got so much backup. I'm trying to get rid of them, but he's aggressive. Ah. Was going to be a head... What I thought would be a lethal headshot was very much not. Die, 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 die. Dang it. I just want to kill your backup. You pain in the ass. Ah. Nope. God, it takes for it to load a gun. Nope, nope, that's not working out. God, die. Die! God damn it! Okay. I just get a little bit of space. Jesus Christ, they're so much harder to kill than all the ones in the entire level. Go down! <laughs> Die, die, die. Okay. Now it's just the that one ghosty dude. There you go. Yeah. There we go. Ow. There we go. There goes your yokai realm. Yep. Come on, finish me up. There we go. There we go. This is over, right? There we go. Ah, peace and quiet. <laughs> It's so much easier the moment that they die, but damn, the two extra people constantly hitting me with shit was getting old fast.
Got him, though. And then the fight's not too hard to manage at that point. But yeah, fighting a boss while two guys shoot you <laughs> is a bit much. Sir Anjan, I am truly in your debt. You have restored peace to Sawayama Castle. The rest of you may leave us. For the sake of the pe- The rest of you may leave us. Who are we- Are these all supposed to be, like, in front of a bunch of people? I don't have a context for where this dialogue's coming from. <laughs> I always thought these were, like, personal messages. Uh, for the sake of the peace that Lord Ayasu longs for, no sign of what has happened here can be allowed to remain. I must ask you too, Saranjan, not to let word of this pass- of this to pass your lips. The rest of you may leave us. That's- that's weird. That's weird to get to, like, the- I think we just got to the end of the entire game, and for the first time, it, it like, acknowledges the idea that other people might be uh, witness to those messages? That's just never crossed my mind until just this moment. Weird. The Inheritance. This is going back a while. But there is a certain item I accidentally left behind at Honoji Temple. If you can find it for me, I will give it to you. Uh, I will give it to you. Will you not go and look? But be warned, it seems that a chill air lingers over Honoji as yokai gather there. Be careful. If you can find it for me, I will give it to you. You don't need to give it to me. If I find it, then I already found it, and that's it. Ding. It's weird. He contextualizes it like I'm finding something for him, but it sounds like really, it's like, hey! I left something useful there. If you want it, you can go find it. That's it. Hanoji. A temple in the northern area of Yam uh, Yamashiro no Kuni, and the final resting place of Oda Nobunaga. Killed... was this the ice lo was this the ice level from way back? Uh, killed just before he was able to realize his ambition of uniting all of Japan. Known as both demon and hero for getting control of nearly all Japan in unprecedented speed, Oda Nobunaga was killed in 1582 when he was betrayed by one of his allies, and his sudden death sent shockwaves throughout the land. The betrayer, Akechi Mitsuhide, was himself quickly killed, and his intentions in killing Nobunaga remained shrouded in mystery. Even now, nearly 20 years later, no one enters the temple for fear of the curse of Oda Nobunaga. Is this the ice level from way back or something? It is. Weird. Do I have time to be going on journeys like this? Uh-oh, do I have to refight that one lady? That, that, that... That fight gave me some real trouble back then. Oh, what the heck? Where's my shrine? Oh god. Hi. Is that a barrier? It is a barrier. Oh, weird. Weird. I was like, the level hasn't started yet because there hasn't been a shrine yet. There's always like a shrine at the beginning, the beginning of levels. Huh. Unless it's a boss fight level, I suppose. There are levels where you just fight one boss and that's the whole level. Ow. Well, I got rid of the yokai realm, but at what cost? You're down. Can you stop that, please? You're being rude. There we go. More, I guess? Nope, door's open. I assume another gauntlet is waiting inside. No, not you guys. You aggravating crap. Alright, come on. There we go. Yep, yeah, I, so I thought the completely shattered stamina might give me some help. Ow! I guess I didn't hit it correctly. What? I hit him! I hit the weak side. What's up with that? Are you selective about when it's vulnerable? There we go. Yeah, what the heck? Huh. Oh. <laughs> I thought it was an eyeball. I thought it was the little guys that try to sap your strength and come after you. Uh oh! Oh ho! Oh no! Wow, I'm alive. Bit of a crowd over there, huh? Man, it takes a long time to block again when you throw something. Despite how far along we are, somehow I'm always surprised by how slowly your character recovers from that animation.
There we go. Clear. Now, if you could drop some elixirs to make up for my mistakes I've made so far, that'd be nice. They did not. Tengu. Oh, whoa, that was a weird collision. That did not look like it was going to hit me. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> got bad news for you. Oh, you got me. Dang. <laughs> Up on the rafters. What? Okay. His stick has a weird hitbox. What? Alright, fine. There we go. That was an evasion that worked out. Anyone else? So these are the admissions of Mitsuhide about what he was going going to do. Or er, Mitsunari? Crap. Mitsunari, Mitsuhide. Akechi Mitsuhide? Mitsunari. Shit. I can't remember which one's which now. What? Weird, like his head didn't count as a hitbox. Ooh! Oop. Friend! Stop that. Wow, you have like infinite key, what the hell? Look at it. I did so many key draining things. Yeah, he just has like infinite key. Holy crap. That's a problem for me. What the heck? Okay. That'll work. Except he doesn't collapse because he has infinite key. Ow. Ow! Jesus! Nope, that's not working. Nope, that was a bad idea. <laughs> I'm so used to, I'm just used to people falling over when I do that to them. We have to recover key now. Because one of us doesn't have like infinite of it. As far as I can tell, he has a huge amount of recovery. And he must just have a huge st defensive stat that stops me from draining his key. Because his attacks do drain his. But that's it. Only he can seem to drain his own key. What? Oh no, he can heal? Uh oh. He's giving me trouble. Oh, that was a miss. <laughs> uh oh. Hey, buddy. Just gonna keep going. Watch out, watch out, watch out. There goes my health, though. Shit. What? Oh, he shot me, didn't he? Ah, oh, he shot me. Alright. 
So do I have to replay the entire level now? Is that how this works? No, it looks like the previous parts of the gauntlet are gone. And it's just him. Okay. Yeah, he seems to have functionally infinite uh, key. Uh, except for his own usage of his key, I suppose. Because hitting him doesn't drain it by any measurable amount, and it refills almost instantly. So the only one that can drain his key, I think, is just him using attacks. But I don't think he's going to be dumb enough to drain it all the way on his own. Damn it. Yeah, he's not his key is not going down. Oh crap. Damn it. I'm sitting here prepping my th uh, my attack I'm going to launch while he's on the ground because but I'm forgetting he never goes down. You can stab him in the spine and he doesn't go down. Damn it. I need to figure this guy out. Oh, not even not even talisman, huh? That's too that's too slow too. Get out, get out. What? Oh. Ah. Yeah. I'm trying to keep an eye on him so I don't let him heal. I don't know how often he'll try to do that. Ow. Pain. <gasps> He's out of key. Yes. 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 What's he doing right now? Dude, what are you doing? Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. Okay, I win. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> So this entire this entire location continues to be devastated by the the uh, murder of a Lord Nobunaga by one of his own men. Oh yeah, it spawned it over where he died, huh? That I'd check around, but I don't think there's anything else to interact with around here. この Genbu. It's a turtle with a spiky shell and a snake coming out of its back. There's something different. That guy had a harder key meter to drain than most bosses. 
but then it finally collapsed and it's like he it's like I kicked the will out of him at that point like once once his key had uh, run out and he collapsed from the, for the rest of the fight it was just like I give up beat me I guess I was concerned that you would not find it but just looking at you I can see that you did well you may keep the armor it is of no use to me to me anymore but it may do you some good I will content myself with watching your exploits from afar. So I take it the idea is that his armor was actually what became possessed and attacked me and everything. And I was fending off the armor itself. So I do still have the maximum level sword mission to do, Zen and the Sword are one. I am Yagyu Sekishuhashi. Su Sekishusai. No words are needed. Show me all that you have learned. If your power can overcome even my sword, I will entrust you with my mystic art. No, don't talk about mystic arts. This is in Tales of Berseria. No. <laughs> got this one, and I, got th I think we got the ninja one to do still. But I think these are all just micro boss fights. Yeah, they're generally like a boss fight against like an NPC style, like regular enemy, but he has like usually like one special trick of some kind. That's all I get, huh? All right. Ow. Hey there. Nope. Not looking so great after I impale the crap out of you. Ow. Well, that's working out pretty well for me so far. Hey there. There we go. Well, he's like halfway down now. Yagyu Seki Suhaishi. Uh-oh. That's bad. Well. Quick heal. Oh, you can't counter that, I don't think. I tried to, at least. Whatever counts as a grapple, technically, or something. There you go. Oop. Oh no, my key. <laughs> Grave mistake taken here, made here. Ow. Counterattack. There we go. First try. Got a little close. No, I still had a whole extra heal left. That actually went really well. There we go. That's the fight that unlocks for you getting nine 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 sword skill or whatever. Which I guess is the only skill I've maxed out. So I guess there's a series of boss fights for maxing out every single weapon skill. If you really want to stick with each one. I don't know if I could stick with the hammer slash axe long enough to max that one out. That'd be rough. Just... I guess if I was, if I was playing the entire game again from scratch, I might give that a shot. I don't, I don't know if I'd really feel like changing now, though. Superb. The way of the sword is perfected when sword and zen are one. When a myriad of things are united, the esoteric techniques of the Shinkage school, I hereby transmit to you. I pray that the next time we meet, we can fight as two lone swordsmen and nothing more. New mystic art has been added for the sword. I don't know what that means, honestly. Oh, we have titles. More living weapon durability. 
That's it. Mystic cards. Oh, is that these guys back here? Reduces key consumption when dodging with the sword equipped as your main weapon. Increases damage dealt when attacking enemy with, from behind with a sword. That's what these two are that we've been waiting to get for a long time, huh? And there's these ones. These are interesting. Learning a more advanced version of the same skill will replace the previous one. Can I only pick one of these, maybe? These are interesting little passives to get. Okay. Let's reduce the cost of dodging. You learned a Mystic Art. You can equip with one of each type of Mystic Art. The Mystic Art that's not equipped will not grant any effects. Okay, so I can only pick one. There we go. So that one's set. I get, I get, I get lower cost dodges. Okay. The other one's also an option. What about? I'm not sure how passives compare. That's interesting that those are suddenly down there. Are they at the bottom of every one? They are. They're prob they're almost certainly universal, right? Interesting. Oh, that's new. The Odachi. New weapon type. Sword, dual sword, spear, axe, kusari gamma, and Odachi. I don't know what an Odachi is, I'm gonna be honest. Uh play movie. Giant sword? Is it like a broad sword, but like the samurai equivalent, which is of course not Yeah. So Nadachi is like a two-handed greatsword, but for by like katana standards. Interesting. It must have been added to the new in the new DLC, right? A true ninja required dexterity. 20 and I've got 24. I hear you've learned all sorts of ninja techniques from Lord Hanzo. If you want to know more, I'd be happy to teach you, William. Just one thing. You have to beat me in a in a fight first. This won't be like la like it was at Endo at Edo Castle. Prepare yourself. Are you actually going to be harder? Why would she be harder this time? I wonder. And what tools am I allowed this time? Wait, is this not the dojo? We're loading somewhere else. Oh, the ogress location. Interesting. I'm given a few different options here. Okay. Guess who doesn't necessarily remember what all these items are? <laughs> the poison shuriken. This is the caltrops on the ground. This blinds people. That's the poison. That makes me more powerful for a bit. Ground fire. So it's a time. It's a timer slash mine. Yeah, it's a mine. It's a proximity to mine slash time to mine. Hypnosis. Survive even if your health goes down to zero. A lot of weird little tricks here. Okay. None of them are the ones I like to use, though. It's weird that I'm being forced into a ninja setup, but it's not the ninja setup I actually use all the time. But are you, are you, are you still super parryable, though? Ow. Uh oh. Alright. Well, you're gonna be a trip, aren't you? Oh. Missed that. Badly. God damn, I cannot connect a hit. Oh god, why am I doing that? I made some grand mistakes there. Enjoy my toys. More fire. <laughs> Playing with fire. She's just not gonna cross those? Is it that effective? Wow, she won't. If only I could shoot her with the bow right now, huh? She's sneaking over. Does she know what- Oh, there it goes. <laughs> Amusing, but does like no damage to her health bar. There we go. Oh, 
Go! That threw me for a loop. Ah. She definitely counts as something different. She doesn't have the same moveset as all the other humans at the very least, because she's a straight-up boss fight. But she does have a key meter. And I can work with that. Come on. Oh, that's all I got. Uh oh. No, that's not good. Uh. It's screwing with me that the, all my items are moved around, so like I'll try to heal and I'll end up throwing something instead because the heals are moved. Ah, oh, crap. Crap. It does mean when she misses. I impaled her, but that's not enough to actually get a... a ah. Impaling her is not enough to actually apply poison. <laughs> ah, crap. Damn it again. There we go. Connect your hits, damn it. <laughs> Ow. No. Oh. Don't know. Come on. There we go. Whew, that was significantly closer than the last one was. Well, believe it. Yeah. <laughs> Second time around, if I did that again, I could have, I could have abused the Caltrop tricks where you put the stuff on the ground everywhere. Like that, I could have used that better against her to uh, manipulate where she was going. Probably, uh, first time around, I was just kind of fooling around because it's not, it's just toys I'm not used to having. But as per usual, like just being able to counter her attacks is pretty much more than enough to defeat her. You just have to make sure you're within a range that that is, you're gonna get hit by the correct one in the combo because that one where she misses then follows up that. Well, screw with me. A strong one, aren't you? Well, as promised, I'll teach you my technique. I think that with this, you've learned all the techniques we have to share. From this point on, your opponent will be yourself. Be diligent in your training. The, par the path of the ninja must be walked alone, after all. But if you ever want a sparring partner, come visit me again. I can't stand ending on a loss. Now we have a ninjutsu. Mystic Art, which I probably cannot afford right now. Increases damage dealt by long-range weapons or thrown items. Yes. Enables you to instantly perform any just so you use on yourself. Ah, Dang it. So, if it's a ninjutsu you use on yourself, it happens instantaneously, but I don't currently use any of those. I guess Galnaut Broth? So, if I, was, if I was adding poison to my weapon, I could do that instantly now, which is great. But, uh, it'd be great if I could throw instantly. So I'd probably go for the increased damage, but I need to save up points. They might have just given me those points, though. Samurai locks. Ninja locks. Hey, they gave me just enough. That's probably completely intentional, actually. Let's go for the, the damage dealt. There we go. Concealment. They were nice enough to give me the, thing, the item I needed to be able to do that. How are we doing on memories? The Obsidian Samurai. Since ancient times, visitors from faraway countries have found their way to Japan's shores. One of them was a man known as the Obsidian Samurai, who found himself in Japan through a series of extraordinary circumstances. Though the Obsidian Samurai did not come to Japan of his own accord, he remained here under Nobunaga's protection, who he served as Samurai. No matter where he may have come from, 
He proved a capable addition to Nobunaga's forces.